guys, what is going on and welcome back to What Shall We Do Next? I'm Mike, your host, and I hope you guys are having the best day ever. Before I get started, guys, if you are new here, please subscribe if you haven't already done that. We're on the road to 74,000 subscribers, and I would love you to join me on this journey. So hit subscribe right now and join the fam. And also, guys, go follow me on all my social media. Links are in the description. I have Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and even Snapchat, so go follow me on all of those. And as you guys know, I've recently started a Facebook account, so you guys can add me on Facebook and we can be Facebook friends. Link is in the description. And finally, be sure to hit that little notification bell right next to the subscribe button. That way you will get notified whenever I upload a video. Thank you. But once again, I am coming back at you guys with another creepy video. And today, we are talking about another urban legend. And this urban legend is called Bloody Mary. But enough of the jibber jabber. Let's get right over to the story. This is the real story of Bloody Mary. You're probably wondering if she is real or just an urban legend. Well, the truth is that she's real, or at least she was real. The legend of Bloody Mary is based on a true story. Bloody Mary, according to the legend, you have to stand in a bathroom with one candle lit and say the name Bloody Mary into the mirror three times in a row. It is only the bravest of people who would attempt to do this because the story says that this will summon her ghost. If you see her ghostly face in the mirror, it could have one of the following terrible consequences. Number one, your eyes being ripped out and your face horribly scarred. Number two, being found dead with claw marks all over your face and body. Number three, disappearing mysteriously from the bathroom and ending up trapped in the mirror with the ghost for eternity. Number four, you could also be driven insane or drop dead on the spot. The Bloody Mary legend. The history of the chanting game is based on mixed up legends and history that over the years have become the main basis for the story surrounding the urban legend. The most common story told is that Bloody Mary was a witch that lived over a hundred years ago who dabbled in the black arts. She was found out and executed. The second story is more modern. A local woman who was involved in a fatal car accident and her face was horribly scarred before she died. She reappears in the mirror when summoned with that same horrific face. There is another suggestion that the name Mary Worth was derived from a victim of the Salem witch trials. The fourth story is that Bloody Mary is based on a historical figure, Queen Mary of England. How do you play Bloody Mary? What you need is one candle, a strong heart, and a big bathroom with a large mirror. Turn out the lights, place your candle down, and light it. Stand and look into the mirror. Chant slowly, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary, and see what happens. If nothing happens, try spinning around three times, and then look into the mirror. You may just catch a glimpse of her terrifying face. Try it out if you dare, but don't blame me if you find yourself trapped in a ghostly netherworld with the ghost of Bloody Mary forever. And that is the end of that, guys. As I was saying in yesterday's video about the Candyman, um, I have done this before, and there is video of that on my channel. So if you guys go and look through my playlist, I have a playlist that says it's got all of my scary games and challenges and mirror games all in this um, playlist. So you guys can check it out. I did do the Bloody Mary one, um, and it's, it's pretty creepy. But again, nothing really happened. It's similar to the last one. 
but when I play these games, I'm kind of expecting nothing to happen, so I don't know, I did try uh, uh, to do it in a bunch of different ways, apparently there's like a bunch of different ways to do it, so I did try in a bunch of different ways, but nothing really seemed to happen, but it's still a pretty cool video if you guys want to watch. But my question to all of you guys for question of the day is, have you tried the Bloody Mary challenge? Did anything happen for you? If you haven't tried it, would you? Let me know in the comment section. That is question of the day. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button down below. Let's see if we can go for a billion likes on this video. I would really appreciate that. And remember the most important thing of all, guys, chase your dreams. I love you all. Don't let anybody bring you down. Peace out.